Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Total Biscuit. I know, my parents were cruel. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do about it. The purpose of this short video is to let you know that I've decided to enter the King of the Web contest. Now, this is a contest that does run fairly frequently as far as I can tell. You might have heard about it from Jesse Cox, who decided it would be a good idea to try and win by claiming I would sing a song which he then neglected to tell me about in any form or get permission for. Dirty tactics, they work folks, it's simple as that. But the song will be coming regardless because you know what, I'm just nice like that. No, I'm not, I'm actually a terrible person. So, in order to try and atone for me being a terrible person, what I'm going to try and do is win this contest in order to give the prize money to charity. You may be aware that I've been supporting the Yogscast with their justgiving.com slash Yogscast appeal for Oxfam, which has been buying goats for families in third world countries. Now, unfortunately, because I supported that, I can't really then go and ask you guys to give money as well, because, well, that's kind of double dipping, and I know you guys have limited cash. We all have limited cash. So, I found a different way to try and raise some money, and that's to try and win the King of the Web contest, which has a $7,500 prize. So, if we do win that, then all of that money will go directly to Charity Water, which is my chosen charity, has been for a while, that provides clean drinking water to third world villagers, and they do so by creating sustainable water projects. So, basically, digging wells and purification systems for third world villagers. Now, your average sort of well and purification system cost between about five and seven and a half thousand dollars and obviously the really big ones for the larger villages and towns cost upwards of about twenty thousand dollars but if we were able to win this then we should be able to set up our own well in one of these third world villages and hopefully give a lot of people clean drinking water and as many of you are probably aware and if you're not then you certainly are now Dirty drinking water, contaminated drinking water, is one of the leading causes of death in third world countries. It's really simple as that. These people don't have clean water to drink. As such, they tend to catch diseases, not to mention the whole idea not having enough water in general to drink, which of course causes people to die of dehydration. So that's not exactly a great situation to be in. Now, King of the Web allows you to vote 10 times a day, and as far as I can tell, these votes seem to roll over as well, so you get 10 points every day, which you can then attribute to whoever you want, so you don't have to put them all into one person. If you want to vote for multiple people, you can do that. Now, we did get into this a little bit late. The contest did start a few days ago, and as a result, there is someone who is definitely in the lead by a fairly significant margin. However... I think we've got the clout to win this, and giving that person a sporting head start seemed like a reasonable thing to do. But now we're going to come back, and hey, that makes it exciting, doesn't it? Yeah, let's put a little bit of thrill in it. Not really all that interesting if you're on top from the very start. I don't like that. I think being the underdog is quite fun, so let's do that. We've got 12 days to win it, so I think we can manage that. It seems like a lot of votes that we need, but in reality, since you can all vote 10 times a day, it's actually far less than you might think. So I reckon we can do this. I don't see a problem with that, so let's give it a shot. So head on over, if you wish to support this project, to tinyurl.com slash vote total biscuit. That's tinyurl.com slash vote total biscuit. Purpose of which is simply to sign up to the site. You sign up, you get a verification email, and then you can start voting, and you can vote 10 times a day with the vote points that they give you. Simple as that, really. And if we win it, then all of that money goes to Charity Water. We've already got a registered campaign with them, so it's all set up through them and all above board. And they'll actually provide pictures and GPS location and information about our project as well. So we'll be able to see exactly what happened if we win this and we're able to actually fund a water project of our own. I think that would be pretty awesome, to be honest, and considering the extra attention the channel's been getting over the last few days due to the SOPA video, I think it would be good to try and turn that extra attention into something good. It would be nice to turn it into a charitable donation, and of course to raise awareness for that particular charity and the problems that are happening over in third world countries. Because you know what? Yes, we're fighting against the censorship of the internet and all sorts of good stuff like that, and that's a very important cause, but... There are kids over in third world countries that are dying of lack of clean water. <laughs> That's a fairly basic human right as far as I'm concerned. And anything that we can do to improve that situation, I feel would be greatly appreciated. And we should do that if we have the power to do so. So let's give it a shot, shall we? Hell, even coming in second would give us a smaller prize as well that we could donate there. But if we come in first, we can fund an entire water project for a third world village. I think that's pretty badass. So let's do that. Let's do that for Christmas, folks. And I very much appreciate your votes. Thank you very much. My name has been Total Biscuit and continues to be so. I will see you next time.